Thank you! Thank you so much! We like snacks! We do like snacks! How are you? <laughs> you get attacked by the munchies on a daily basis? Munchies! I like snacks. What's my to-go snack right now? What have I been eating snack-wise? I don't even know. Mongos? Like dried mongos? I'm running out. I need to get more. I'm gonna go to Bulk Barn and get so many mongos. So many. Had a dream I was playing Phasmophobia, but IRL, it was terrifying. Oh my god! Wow. TJ! Hello! Thanks for the resub for 14 months. How are you? Good to see you. Zab's brand pretzels? They're like voodoo flavored pretzel sticks and a honey mustard one. Both very good. I the pretzels are so freaking good. Yeah, I don't know what a voodoo flavored pretzel stick is, but I would eat it. I I love pretzels. Pretzels are probably my favorite carb. Probably. I don't know. I just like carbs. What's this? A survey. I got mail. Mora. Mora? Meeting time. Have a good meeting, Allie. Yeah, I still don't know what to do with this. Where to go, what to do. I'm not even in that map yet. Slightly sour, sweet, spicy kind of flavor from Louisiana. Ooh. Fancy. That sounds really good. I had french fries last night for dinner. <laughs> I wanted french fries and I had some in my freezer, so I made french fries. Oh yeah, I should probably grab the story. Ko West's story. Uh, let's do Ganyu first. You guys want to do Ganyu first? Okay, we're gonna start with Ganyu. Unlock. Accept quest. Navigate. She's super close. She's like right there. That event is uh, for talent up materials, but you're playing on hard mode, so you d don't level up your talents. Oh my god. I don't mean to not level up. <laughs> I'm just trying to figure the these things out on my own. And uh, they're causing me to uh, die a lot. <laughs> Ganyu is one of your uh, one of your favorite TCG cards. That's cool. Who needs talents when you have ultimate power? The ultimate power of like button mashing. Yes. For like an hour because you're so uh, low level, <laughs> like me. Ah. It's sad, but true. Why am I going over here if I have to go over there? I was following the yellow brick road. Don't mind me. I'm just gonna take a shortcut. I'm just gonna climb walls. I stick to walls, so might as well use them. Look at that banana. Look at that Spider-Man. This is me, Spider-Man. I'm in a different universe. I have short hair and I'm wearing a dress. I didn't feel like wearing my mask. 
I'm here to save the world. I want pictures! Pictures of the Traveler! <laughs> yep. Sounds about right. So a new Fortnite tonight. Is it tonight? Is it gonna be able, uh, available tonight? Banana Dam? It's shocking how much work there is to Oops. do, even for the three of us. He turns into a pickle? That's so cute. <laughs> he has crazy grits, grip, grip strength. Alright, we're starting the story. We're doing it. We're doing the thing. And she's been handling it alone all along. The Chising secretary clearly isn't an ordinary person. It's so frustrating. Huh? You're... Mm, yes, I'm Spider-Man. It's me. Aren't you Ningguang's servants? How come you're here? <clears throat> we are Miss Ningguang's private secretaries, not servants. Yeah. <sighs> Have I'm you seen on. Miss Ganyu, Traveler? It has been several days since Ganyu left for Joyun Karst. She's the general secretary of the Liyue Qixing. We've only taken over her responsibilities until she gets back. What happened? Ah, even though the Qixing have made peace with the Adepti after the latter had denounced Liyue, they still want to pay their respects to the Illuminated Ones. They commissioned Ganyu as their envoy to deliver a letter to Julian Karst and bring the Adepti the latest news about the crisis. Okay. Still... Ganyu should have been back to her usual responsibilities by now, but she's disappeared without a trace. I hope she's okay. Is that so? Maybe Ganyu just took a little detour. Who can blame her after working so hard? Yeah, maybe she, you know, took a nap under a tree. Or went to get a snack somewhere. I'm afraid it's not very likely. Ever since we met Ms. Ganyu, she's been nothing but the most conscientious person in all of Liyue. Even when it's time for her annual leave, Ms. Ganyu stays on duty at Yuahai Pavilion saying, There is still so much to do. That's cute. She couldn't possibly be using her mission as an excuse to slack off. Well... Oh, Paimon sees how it is. But she's half adeptus. She wouldn't get in trouble, right? Why do you look so upset? It's because of this absurd workload of hers. <sighs> when we first heard the three of us would be taking over for Miss Ganyu, we thought it would simply be a matter of changing our work environment. <sighs> we couldn't have imagined that Miss Ganyu's daily workload far exceeds what the three of us are used to doing. Mm, the Adeptus lineage is truly remarkable. Shouldn't you get back to work? No, that's not. Who am I to tell them to get back to work? Speaking of Julian Karst, Traveler, I've heard that you can go in and out of there as you please. Of course! We've been there lots of times! Yeah. Ah, oh, that's good news. Could you go to Julian Karst and find Miss Ganyu for us? Preferably where before we collapse under this workload. I don't even know where that is. Seems like I'm the only one who can do it. Indeed. I'll do it. Lives are at stake here. Ah, oh, you must be their oh, supervisor. Saved. Maybe. I remember Miss Ganyu said that she'd be visiting Cloud Retainer's abode. You might as well start looking for her there. It's about time she came back to work. Otherwise, oh. no. Perhaps we should go to Lady Ningguang first and bring up our overtime pay again. Legs. Lady Legs. Hi, <laughs> Spider-Man. I'm your biggest fan. So Ganyu left Hi, to visit Spider Cloud Retainer. Doesn't she live in Mel Outsong? Mm. Where do we have to go? Way up there? Holy cheese balls. Okay, let's 
let's teleport. Whee! We should hurry up. Hyman hopes we can find her there. Who is Spider-Man? Hi, Fairy Wing. Hello. How are you? It's good to see you. Um, where are we? Let's climb up this mountain. It's good to see you. Hope you're doing well. I'm not Spider-Man. I just happen to always take pictures of him. <laughs> yeah, a little suspicious if you ask me. Those pictures are so good. You must know him at least. I want to go to the top. Don't mind me. Oh look, it's a bird. Rotate? Why would I want to rotate? What does it do? Okay. I don't know what that did. Anyway, I'm going this way. <laughs> Are you sure you're not Spider-Man? Oh, Paimon remembers. Doesn't that- wait, what? Last time we had to offer food. Uh, Paimon, I don't know what you're talking about. We're not doing what you're asking right now. We're coming over here. We're gonna talk to her. Oh, the person standing over there! That's Gunyu! We finally found her! Hello, girly pop! How you doing? What's going on? Well, this would make a really nice photo. Alright, let me just do that. Nice photo. Now kiss. That's pretty. That's so nice. Save. F. Got you. Here you are. <laughs> you two. I did not expect to meet you here. Is it official or private affairs that bring you here? <laughs> You're glad my aunt disappeared for that photo? I wanted her to stay! She never stays for the photos for some reason. She's camera shy. Ah yes, the ancient art of bird rotation. <laughs> yeah, the ancient art of bird rotation. Yep. <laughs> Gun you, I like your horns. I have like similar ones here. I never wore- I wore them once for like a costume. <laughs> a long time ago. Oh, little- little horns. They're just sitting there with all my hats. Oh, I shouldn't. I have left the human world. Please Left. contact the Yua High Pavilion regarding matters concerning the commercial port. Wait, what do you mean you left the human world? Huh? You don't want to be the Chising secretary anymore? But they're all waiting for you to come back! That's why you're here? You want me to come back? I'm afraid you came here in vain. What? Did something happen? The clouds fold and unfold. The tide ebbs and flows. It was meant to be. <laughs> the Taco Bell man. When the Adepti entrusted humans with overseeing Leoa, I knew it was only a matter of time until I had to leave. Aww. My Adepti blood makes me unwelcome in Leoa Harbor. <sighs> I delivered the letter and came back to Leoa Harbor, only to discover that I had been replaced by Baiwen, Bai Shao, and Bai Shu. Perhaps that mission of mine was just a pretext to remove me. Um. Since the Chi Sing gave me a chance to leave with dignity, I decided to be tactful as well. I believe there's been a huge misunderstanding. I appreciate your kindness, but there's no need for your words of comfort. Okay. After a thousand years away, 
I came back to Juyun Karst. Looking at the clouds floating among the mountains brings me peace of mind. I feel better now. Uh, but... Who disturbs the peace of these mountains? It's the bird! It's Cloud Retainer. Cloud Retainer? We're terribly sorry, we just... <clears throat> One merely jests. One felt your presence the moment you set foot upon this land. <laughs> Hello, bird! <laughs> wow! You adept I really are impressive! Come here to chat about the old times with Ganyu. It looks like you get along quite well. Chat about old times? <sighs> ah, a matter leaves you at an impasse then. Not to worry. One is exceptional at seeking avenues for conversation. One has been one's own companion in idle talk for many a year. Ah, yes. Since you are Ganyu's friends, tales from her youth shall one apprise you of, perhaps? She should sell her skincare routine. Have a few friends that would really like that. Um, I'm gonna assume it's just drinking a lot of water. Oh, cloud retainer. <laughs> Maybe Nothing to be ashamed of. You were so cute as a child. One is most certain that your friends would like to hear of it. Magic has something to do with it. The fact that she's not really human. I don't know. I don't know. I'm a bit curious indeed. Yes, about the skincare routine, me too. Oh, Paimon wants to hear it! Uh. <laughs> Little Ganyu loved when the horns on the top of her head were caressed. <laughs> Magic. Drinking lots of water. Got it. <laughs> when one was still taking care of her, one was pestered most often to touch her horns. She was elsewise loath to sleep. Wow. Yeah. Plump she was back then. Why, when she stumbled while we ascended the mountain, she would roll down to the bottom like a little ball. <laughs> the day Ganyu bumped into a pilgrim was the first time she saw a real human in the flesh. So fearful she was that she hid in a rock's cleft for two days and nights. One found her wailing of a monster she had seen. <laughs> Cloud retainer? Uh, forget it. It's like an embarrassing it's about time parent. For my I will take my leave. Just like showing like old pictures of your kid. I think you upset Ganyu. Huh. One's intention was merely to relieve the awkward tension. And you did the exact opposite. Impressive! <laughs> Be that so? Huh. But returning to Ganyu, most gladdened one is of your arrival. One cannot help but feel that remaining in Dreyun Karst shall not be good for her. Hmm. One will tell you more about her, if you should permit it. Most benevolent among all Adepti are the Chilin. They drink only spring water and eat only whole grain. I told you! But perhaps the mountainous dwellings of Adepti in Joyun Karst might be too lonely for her human side. Under moonlight did one see her last. She stood by the precipice's edge. And upon the mist-veiled mountains she gazed. Her thin figure was immersed in the vast sea of clouds. One noticed her loneliness and sought to convince her to go back to the human world. But just then, she said thus. Liyue Harbor feels even lonelier than Juyun Karst. When I look at the sea of clouds in Juyun Karst, they merely feel the loneliness of a solitary cloud gazer. 
When I step into the sea of people in Liyue, I feel the loneliness of an inhuman that doesn't belong in the human world. One did, by chance, hear this much of Ganyu's thoughts. Alone, she will find her predicament hard to conquer. One hopes that you will accompany her. Oh, Retainer's right. We can't leave Ganyu depressed like that. Besides, Liyue hasn't given up on her. She's got it all wrong. Anyways, what's that training Ganyu was talking about? She has sought to reclaim her adeptus side since returning to Zhuoyun Karst. At her behest, one has organized training for her to achieve that end. She should be in the southern part of Mount Outsong right now, preparing for the trial. Wait, her voice changed. Did you guys notice that? It like went from like echoey to like not echoey. Okay, let's go, I guess. Didn't notice shit. <laughs> Giraffe! one pet. Giraffe, thank you for the pet that dog biddies. Thank you so much. The stance. What is this? Are we good? Are we good, Spider-Man? Whoa, what is going? <laughs> what a pose! Balance is impressive. Yep, I am joining the circus. I am trying to climb the tree, and it's not letting me climb the tree. Okay, I think we're good. I am looking for uh this thing that was right here i thought it was up in the tree oh look it's those things those elemental dragons i want to kill both of you so i can get all that treasure but not right now i have to go to here Call the fire department stuck in a tree. Yeah. Um, so I don't know how I got stuck there. <laughs> so here you are, Ganyu. Why did you come here? We want to keep you company. I'd like to try this adeptus training. What? Keep you company. Ah, I... Uh, humans should not remain in the realm of Adepti for too long. Okay. Hmm. Considering the kindness you have shown me, I can let you stay for the Adeptus training. We're gonna learn things! Yay! We're gonna become an Adeptus. This trial was prepared by Cloud Retainer. Its goal is to help me feel like an Adeptus again. The training is much to her signature style. I hope it won't make it seem like she is too unaware of the abilities of others. Is it difficult? No, I'm aware of your strength, Traveler. The power hidden within you is not inferior to mine. If you're ready, we shall begin the training. Let's do it. I'm gonna do it. What are we doing? Oh, bow and arrow. Okay. Got one. Got two. Going through the circles. Got three. Is there another one? <gasps> There's a wisp. I 
I have like three minutes to do this? I didn't even notice that I had a, tra uh, a timer. Oops. Okay, let's go to there. There's a lot of gliding around. It does feel like something Cloud Retainer would come up with. We're just gliding around. It's what we do. I'm not going up. There we go. Ooh. Hello? Almost hit my head on that. Okay, we made it to the top. Ish. I think I hit that. I did. <laughs> I hit that. I got that one too. Anywhere else? Hello? Over here. Nice. Is a really awesome shooter. If you could see through the eyes of an adeptus, you wouldn't be so surprised. Look at that! The yellow brick road show up. I gotta follow it. Follow the yellow brick. Oh, I could have brought the wisp to here. Damn it. But no. Too busy. Why can't I hit this? Hello? Hit. The thing. There we go. Up we go. Oh, we got this. Right? We got this. We got this. We got this. Just gonna go stand on this one. Everything's gonna be okay. Why is it shaking like that? Why are you shaking like that? Are you okay? There we go. Can I do the... E. Whoa! We did the thing! <clears throat> it's nervous to share the same platform as you. We've completed the task. Oh no! What do you think? Perhaps I'd make a good... Perhaps I'd make a good adeptus. Being an adeptus test is not easy, I don't know. I agree. You possess many qualities oh, no, similar not. to those of adepti, despite having none of their blood. Ganyu, I bet we're an adepti, we just don't know it. <laughs> I bet we're an adepti, we don't even know it. We're like a god. The training's not over yet. The part prepared by Cloud Retainer is only the first trial. Huh? So there are more trials prepared by other adepti? Is Mountain Shaper next? No. The only adeptus who can unlock my true potential is... Who is it? <laughs> Paimon just interrupting her? Conqueror of Demons. Ooh, who's that? Huh. So it's Shell. That cold-hearted loner? How come he's prepared a trial for you? That's the star we're doing after. What a surprise! How interesting! I found him unapproachable at first, too. But I believe that being able to face him is an important part of my homecoming. He's already waiting for me. Come along if you're interested. Of course Heck we yeah. are! Let's go! Let's do it! Yeah, that's the next story we're doing is Xiao. Hi, Komodo! That's true. Nobody. Nobody ever. How are you? It's so, everything's so blurry. Can't see anything. Are we gonna plummet to our death if we let go? Whee! Guy, lurking and working sounds good. <laughs> You're half an hour late. Wow, I see you still haven't abandoned the wrongful ways of humankind. I don't like his tone. Hey, you, uh, that stick in your butt, do you need help removing it? Because, like, the fuck? I'm sorry, I had a meeting with Cloud Retainer. I 
I don't need your explanations and don't require any mutual understanding between us. I'm just helping you with your training. That's all. <laughs> Again, that stick up your ass. You need help? Uh, cause like we're we're three. We got me, Paimon, uh, Ganyu. We can pull it out. Xiao is such a strict teacher. <laughs> kind of a jerk. Kind of a jerk. You're neither an adeptus nor a human, always treading the line between the two worlds. It must create a lot of confusion. Instead of explaining yourself to me, you should face your true self. I... I have nothing to hide. It seems that Xiao understands Ganyu quite well. Xiao might be a good teacher after all. Huh? Really? Yeah, we feel that way? Is that how we feel? I, that's not how I feel. I feel like he has a stick up his butt. The body and the mind are one. <laughs> it's a Taco if Bell something worries your mind, <laughs> your body can help you find a solution. <laughs> uh, Xiao should face these nuts, got him. Oh my god. The trial I've prepared for you will explore the true potential of your body. Yes. I'm ready. Okay. Let's do it. What are we doing? Going this way? Oops. Oh, I don't have to hit that. I have to go touch it. I'm gonna go touch this thing. The trial's begun! Paimon can feel it in the air. Even the wind has changed! Everything's frozen! I'm freezing everything. Stop it! No! Born of ice and frost. Access denied. Yeah, access denied. Is this the trial? Amber. Wash it up. Leave it all to me. Please. Can I blow this thing up? I'm cheating. I'm using right in. <laughs> Shine down. No touching. Born of ice and frost. Be gone. Bye. 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 Bye! Bye! I love that so much. Bye! There is Bye. no escape! Bye! <laughs> Access denied for Rex Lapis! What is that? I must leave no stone unturned. Next on the agenda, blaze over. Yeah, anything that comes near this thing will die of freezing. Illusion shattered. Bye, mosquitoes. Why can't I? Oh shit. Ow! Corn of ice and frost. No touching. Woof. Corn of ice and frost. Leave it up to me. Shine down. Inazuma shines eternal. I love her so much. She's so crazy. There is no escape. Yeah. Bye. 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 Wingly. <sighs> Time to clean up. Wait, why is it immune to me? Oh, because it's electric. That's okay. Hey, get it. 
No one escapes my sight. There you go. Get distracted by my bunny. That exploded. Wait, there's more guys coming. Super conduct. Nice. Go, go, Baron Mama. Born of ice and frost. No touching. Yeah. I can fix this. Whoa. Next on the agenda. Hey, why didn't you go with your friends? Shine down. You could have died with all of them. Oops. Yeah, she's pretty good. I like her. For an archer. I would like to have her as an icy person. Over Kaya? Like, over- this over- like, her over Kaya would be, like, top tier. I like her. <laughs> stop, stop. <sighs> uh. Hi, Russell. Thanks for the hydrate. I've completed your trial. Yeah. You don't have to report back to me. Seeking other people's validation won't benefit your training. <laughs> Take a rock over Kaya. <laughs> you hear that, Dwayne? <laughs> you just made his day. <laughs> He's so happy. <laughs> You, you over Kaya any day. Will we inherit a, will he inherit an eye patch? Who, him? He could. I don't have anything here that could be an eye patch. Maybe this um, fortune cookie. Fortune could be the eye patch. Here we go. Fortune cookie fortune is the eye patch. That's cute. You can see the joy in his face. He's so happy. Look at how happy he is. <laughs> Aww. <sighs> you hear that, Dwayne? You're on the team. Kaya said his eye patch was inherited. Yeah, apparently all pirates are like that. All of them. <laughs> Dwayne the Pebble Johnson, <laughs> five-star Geo character. Oh my god, I want to draw that. I want to, like, draw that so badly. I would put an anime face, to, like, I would put anime eyes on the... <laughs> uh, it's National Pancake Day here in the Netherlands, so let's eat pancakes. Heck yeah, pancakes. I freaking love pancakes. I'm a pancakes over over waffles any day. Isn't it International Women's Day today? As well? I think my dad sent me a text saying that. And I didn't know. Until he said that. And I still don't know because I didn't fact check. <laughs> Please buy and make women pancakes. 
It is International Women's Day. Happy International Women's Day to all the women out there. You deserve all the things. Everything. You deserve you deserve hugs, kisses, um food, um pets. Not 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 pets like animal pets. You know, all the cats, all the dogs, all the birds, all the snakes. Um squishy toys. Go get yourself a squishy toy. You deserve a squishy toy. I am a woman, hear me roar. So get yourself a squishy toy. But also pets, pets, yes. These. And you deserve you deserve the world. <laughs> oh, thank you, Aaron. <clears throat> Thank you. All right, let's continue. Only you can evaluate the result of this trial. You'll progress faster that way. Um, understood. Xiao always has such strong opinions. He could be nicer while sharing them. He could. He could be nicer. He's a bit of a dick. Yeah, is that what that is? <laughs> okay, sure. There we go. Gengar Hut for 10 minutes. Thank you, Komodo. From tomorrow on, I'll start raising the difficulty of your training, so you'll have to... <sighs> to what? You're gonna have to what, huh? I have to do what? Tell him, Paimon. Tell him. Uh, another one of those pesky visitors. I was gonna say, there's a person in the back. Hi, Mir! Hello! I'll leave him to you, Ganyu. It's also a part of your training. Pesky visitor? So even here, there are those that Xiao can't deal with? It's a visitor. Oh, oh heavens! Blessed be Rex Lapis, I've finally come upon the Adepti. Are all of you the Adepti of this mountain? Uh, great! My name's Sin Chung. I came to ask for your merciful blessings, O Adepti. I beg of you, please grant me luck, wealth, and a good career. <laughs> Aww. I can give you a rock that can help you with that. Have a malachite. Here you go. <laughs> oh, so it's a pilgrim. Uh, I can see why Xiao finds his, his type troublesome. Huh. He can handle any battle. But strange <laughs> humans is a different story, huh? I am also one of the Adepti. You can say that I'm an Adeptus in training. Perfect. I didn't come in vain then. Although you sound a bit half-hearted. Uh, doesn't matter. Half-hearted? Wow. What blessings can you grant me? I can grant you the blessing of... Um, well, if you sneeze, I can say bless you. You want one of those? It's free. Wow. <laughs> Straight to the point, huh? It's free! Dear Pilgrim, you shouldn't jump to conclusions. Adepti don't help every Pilgrim for free. Those are some really pretty flowers. For free? Do you mean that you charge people for the blessings of the Adepti? Ah, uh, that's not what I meant. What I'm trying to say is that Everything should be earned through hard work and earnest living. <laughs> F you pay me, gun you. <laughs> I 
I love that. <laughs> One thousand mora, please. Per blessing. <laughs> it would be unfair to other people if you got everything you wanted for no reason. Hold on, hold on. I've heard this all before. You're just like my old man, always nagging me. I feel like he doesn't practice gratitude a lot. Your father must have experienced it firsthand. The lives of the common folk are riddled with hardships, but are also full of joy. <laughs> a lot of people love their baby. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah. Wow. A person of your age should focus on work and family instead of chasing after fairy tales. Are you a real adeptus? Why do you speak and behave like us city folk? Um, she's, she's making sense though? You sure you're not one of those swindlers who poses an adeptus to cheat people out of their money? She didn't even ask for your money, bro. He can't take criticism. Ah, enough. Doesn't matter if you're a real adeptus or not. You're useless. I'm leaving. <laughs> High achievement. Go practice gratitude and then come back. Then we'll talk. Ugh. People. This guy's a dick. I'm gonna smite him instead. <laughs> Nobody's stopping you. <laughs> Lose the attitude. Get some gratitude. Yeah. Be grateful for what you have now, because now is all that matters. Uh. Can you don't let that guy ruin your mood? Yeah. Uh, it's not his behavior. The things he said. He was right. No, he wasn't. Listen, if you would have given him everything he asked for, he wouldn't have, like, he would have wanted more, okay? This is what happens to people like that. They're, they're, they're never satisfied and they're never happy, okay? So you're fine. It's fine. You're good. You're Gucci. You're great. You're an adeptus. Stas. It's fine. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay, baby girl. I thought that coming back to Julian Karst and devoting myself to training would make me feel like an adeptus again. Aww. But being questioned by him made me realize that I... Mm, go back to Leeway Harbor with us. You're better off sticking with your human side. No, let's go back but to Leeway Harbor. I'm unwelcome in Leo Harbor. As an adeptus, I... We told you it was a misunderstanding. It's true. Just believe us. Uh, all right. I'll go with you to Leo Harbor. That said, I still trust my initial judgment. If I'm proven right, I'll return to Juyun Karst once again. It's a step in the right direction. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, let's go to Liyue Harbor. What just happened? Guide? Here? Oh! Okay. Cool. Now we have to go see Catherine. So she can tell us something? Should we teleport? I think we should teleport. It's gonna be far. It's over here. We're doing great! Aw, oh, this is so pretty. I love this view. I could sit up here and eat a sandwich. And maybe take a nap. And like, you know, watch the sunset because it probably sets over there. That's a sunrise. <gasps> yeah, you could do that too. Hell yeah. It's so pretty. You love mountains?
Okay, we're back. Uh, I'm still... Come on, Ganyu! We're almost there! You don't want to turn back now, do you? I suppose you have a point. It would be quite impolite of me to leave the two of you now. That's right! Where do you want to go first, then? Let's go get a snack! I've spent too much time in the mountains. The first thing that comes to my mind is the sea. I prefer swamps and forests. Wait, are we talking about basic lands and magic? Let's go for a walk in the port. We could be. We could be, Komodo. Happy to come with. Okay, let's go to there. I'm gonna walk there. And see if I missed anything. Get some mats while we're at it. Anything sparkly that we can grab? Oh, hi you! You're so cute! 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 Declare your commercial goods. I declare that this dog is adorable. Is that, is that good enough for you? I love you. I wish I could pet you. Genshin, please give us pet mechanics. Please. That's all we ask. We don't ask for much. I don't think it's a lot. Is it? Hi. Hello. Hello, peddler. There's an event in the next patch where you get to pet cats. I'm gonna be playing 24 seven. Just so I can pet all the cats. All the cats. Cause I love cats. Cats are great. They're soft, squishy, adorable, sweet, independent, and wonderful. At least you get to play with TCG with cats. It's true. You do. Oh, I love Granny Sean. Um, I wanted to go see um her real quick while we're here. Hi, Catherine. Applesauce. Ad Astra Abyssosk. Thank you for completing today's commissions. Thank you for my rewards. Goodbye. Alright, let's go towards where we're supposed to go, which is over here, I think. Yeah. There we are. Somewhere over here. Wait, what? Fresh fish. Wait, what fresh just happened? Fish. Did you guys see that? What was that? A character is involved and can't join this quest. Okay, so I have to go do this one. Okay, let's go do this quest. <laughs> An NPC is busy doing another quest. Okay, let's do the other quest. That's funny. That's so funny. I missed it, do it again. <laughs> I'm swimming. Why am I swimming? I don't want to be swimming. Can I get out of here? How do I get out of here? Help! Oh, me, I fell in the water. Am I gonna die? I can't climb. Okay, there we go. 
He, he, hi! You're the person I'm looking for. What can I do for you youngsters? Here's the order you place with G Fang. The what now? Oh yes, I believe I ordered a copy of Verses of Equilibrium at the Wan Wen Bookhouse. Indeed, indeed. This is the book I wanted. Haha. <laughs> I was beginning to think that G Fang might have forgotten about my order. Uh, what with the, the uh, other customers and all. But here it is now. And that's good. The binding is fairly good as well. Okay. Thank you. Goodbye. Alright, he's free now. Ah, god damn it. <laughs> This is one of two books. I'm swimming, I'm Nermi. Oh my god, Nermi. Yes, yes, I'm swimming. Let's go get the other book and then we can do the- we can continue our quest. It's okay, it's okay. A temporary setback. I love that emote, by the way, achievement with the character with- the, is that undies on its head? I love it. It's funny. Hi, Hi sir. What is it, youngster? Here's the order you place with the G-Fang. <laughs> the fourth volume of Rex Incognito? I placed this order uh, eons ago. Why has it tarried till now? This is a good emote. Good emote. That's why I don't take world quests unless I intend to do them. Uh, I think my intentions were to do them and then ADHD struck. Because I have ADHD and things, if they're not in my um, general. The field of vision, I just forget about them forever. <laughs> Hi, Lord Way! How's it going? Let's see, uh, first edition. Wow, no wonder it took so long. <laughs> to think I'd assume that Ji Fang has forgotten about my book amid all this time, uh, all the other customers. Thank you for delivering the book. All right, this is done. <sighs> The sound of the waves in this familiar Yeah, I don't play part. Elder Scroll. There we go. Now we can continue. The smell of the sea breeze makes me nostalgic. Aren't you? You didn't leave Lyra for that long. Why do you look so moved? Yeah, wasn't she gone for like 20 minutes? Well, I used to be so busy. I haven't taken a stroll around here in a long time. Huh. That's true. Ganyu seemed to be working all the time. Well, when I think about my time here, I've spent most of it behind a desk filing documents. It put me in a certain mood. Similar to the one I felt during my training in Juyun Karst, in fact. Is that... It is! It's Lady Ganyu. There's a guy that was on the boat. <laughs> I wouldn't have thought I'd meet you here. You were always so terribly busy. Lady Ganyu? Why are you calling her that? Recently changed dentist. The last one said some rather mean things to me really hurt my feelings. birthday today by the way hi leaf happy birthday that's a fly i have a fly in my apartment how'd you get in here oh yeah my window's open to my bedroom i'm gonna play you a, a birthday song you know how it goes that's better you ready? You ready? What day is today? It's Leafy's birthday. What a day for a birthday. Let's all have some cake. And you smell like one too. <laughs> Happy birthday. Happy birthday. 
I hope you like your song. <laughs> feels birthday, man. Aw, happy birthday, Leaf. It's good to see you. Thanks, thanks for popping in. What you doing for your birthday today? Your birthday's on a Friday. I hope you're doing something fun. I hope you're eating delicious food. The song was awesome. I'm glad you liked it. I'm gonna go save this fly. At the same time, I'm gonna go pee. I'll be right back. You just finished fixing your internet. Your day started with your mo modem kicking the bucket on you. <laughs> it really sucks. I'll be right back. I'm back. The fly has been saved. And I peed. <laughs> Alright. Let's continue. And I have more water. Yay. Thank you. Hi, chameleon. Hello. How you doing? It's good to see you. Um... Hey, Ganyu, why are you calling her that? It's a bit awkward. <laughs> Little Miss Ganyu. I'm just going to say that. It's not awkward. Why would it be awkward? Uh, please don't also start calling me that. Hi. Hi. Why are you yelling at me? You want to come up? You want to come up? It's my baby. It's my baby. Doing good today. Hope you're having a great Friday. I am. Now we have a little Toki. Who just wants some loving. It's not awkward. How do we make it so? <laughs> oh. How do we make it awkward? We could make it awkward. I think we made it awkward by calling her little little miss <laughs> little miss little lady gone you. <laughs> Hi. Is that all you want? You just want to sit on my lap? He's such a baby. Isn't he the cutest baby? I love my cats. They're the best. The best. You're the best. Look, Chad is there and they love you. He's approaching maximum baby level. Yeah, he's best baby. He's so sweet. <laughs> he's also full of hair. I, I want to shave you. You have any idea how much I want to shave you? I want to give you a little lion cut. When it gets warmer, I'm doing that. I'm going to take you to a groomer and I'm going to get you all lion cut up. <laughs> I think he would like it. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe not. I don't know. I've never done it. I've never done it. Has anyone here ever done a lion cut on their cat? He'd like a lion cosplay. The little lion hat. He doesn't mind wearing shirts. I used to put shirts on him. And he didn't mind it. Like, he would keep them on. He wouldn't be irritated by them. <clears throat> Little line cut for summer. Yeah. Most cats don't notice it's done to them. Okay. I think the ex the experience of getting groomed is the hard part for cats. My cats are rag dolls, though. Like Toki, like this. Look. <laughs> this is what I'm saying. This this is a baby. Like this, he just 
He's fine with this. He's like a little ragdoll. <laughs> That's the sweetest though. Yeah. Like my cats, this is... <laughs> he doesn't want kisses though. He doesn't like kisses. So he pushes my face. Make sure that I don't kiss his face. <laughs> right? You just don't like kisses. But you don't mind me holding you like this. I have boots with the fur. But I also don't know if he likes it. So I'm not gonna hold him like that for too long. We have the furry boots and the poofy tail tip. <laughs> on both my cats. It'd be fun to see them walk around looking like that actually. I'd be interested. But yeah, I think that like... Like Toki at the vet for example. When he gets blood work, he's just, just like chill. He's so chill. Lucky is a little bit more like they'll touch me unless I'm there, but yeah. <laughs> That's my water. Are you gonna drink my water? Please don't drink my water. That's hot water. That's hot water, baby. You have your fountain. He wants to drink my water. He's gonna drink my water. He's drinking my water. It's fine. Ahem. Allow me to introduce Uncle Tian. He is... He is? That's all right. Just tell them the truth. They have done so much for Liu after all, and I am the one who has yet to introduce myself. I can't drink out of the cup anymore. It's covered in hair. <laughs> Uncle Tian is a member of the Liyue Achising, the Tianshu. The Tianshu. What? His grandpa is a member of the Qixing? Ooh. The same rank as Ningguang? Thanks. Hush now. I must ask for your discretion concerning my identity. Fishing in the port and strolling about are the greatest pleasures of my life. I have no wish to be followed around by those armed guards. In most people's eyes, I'm just a forgetful and wordy old man. Oh, okay. <laughs> hmm. He blends Uncle in with the Tian crowd. Is too modest. He's been around for a long time. There's no one who can replace a person of such noble character. Don't judge a book by its cover, they say. I'm trying to remember if I've ever messed with him. <laughs> Did we ever mess with this guy, you think? I'm just gonna say that one. <laughs> uh, what an honor to receive such high praise from Lady Ganyu herself. I guess I must have done something right over the last oh, however many decades. Uncle Tian, please. A person of your standing should really stop calling me Lady Ganyu. <sighs> my apologies. It's not intentional, just a habit from my younger days. <laughs> Thank you for looking after me when I first ascended to my position in the Chi Sing. Oh, so you've been friends for many decades now, huh? My prank at work has been discovered. I switched the M and the N keys on random keyboards at work. Some might say I'm a monster, but others will s s say I'm a nomster. <laughs> Standing ovation for that one. Ah, oh, that's a good one. That's so good. <laughs> a nomster. Do you still want my water? drink my water please don't tip it it's hot it's hot water just be careful with your tongue he's drinking my water he's happy though <laughs> that's all that matters i have my water sippy cup are you poking yourself with the water He's like booping himself with the water. Oh, I was just fulfilling my duties as the Chi Sing secretary. It's nothing worthy of your gratitude. Q. 
cutie. Talking about secretaries, oh, I don't know if I should bring it up. Uh, Ganyu, I believe you know my daughter, Huisin? She seems to be a bit troubled recently. Yes, she works at Yuahai Pavilion and she's my junior. How can I help her? <laughs> I don't know myself, really. Uh, She's all grown up now and doesn't like to ask for my help. May I trouble you to meet her at UAI Pavilion? She just needs a bit of guidance. With pleasure. Solving the Chi-Sing's problems has always been in my job description. She's back in character. Just like that, huh? As expected. Let's move then to UAI Pavilion. You good? You comfy? You wanna keep drinking my water? Okay. <laughs> Alright, where are we going? Oh, we're good? Okay. Guess we're going here. Is that where we're going? Or is this where we're going? Oh, question mark. Feast your eyes on these super fresh fish. <laughs> Cat hair. <laughs> do 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 do. Here, let's go up. one you like please pay over here um it's about those two books have you delivered them yes i have oh wait that's the other quest thank you what's more these customers are true lovers of books it should gladden them greatly to receive book good ones thanks so much for your help traveler take this as your compensation for your efforts if you should ever wish to purchase any books feel free to approach me Books? Wait, what am I doing? Where's my quest? This is what we're doing, right? <laughs> Book! Okay. Let's see, where are we going? Back to there. Okay, let's go to there. Let's climb the walls. For we are Spider-Man. Up we go. You really like my water, don't you? Is there a treasure back here? Looking for treasures. You never know. I found flowers. Hello! <gasps> Miss Ganyu, it's been too long. I don't know why, but seeing you brings me a sense of peace in these chaotic times. Indeed, it has been a while, Huixin. I'm flattered, but aren't you exaggerating a little? I heard that you've encountered some problems and came to see if I could be of some help. <sighs> My father asked you to come, didn't he? Abusing his status as a member of the Chi Sing to trouble you. Oop. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm always happy to help a junior colleague from Yuahai Pavilion. Ganyu's not only a competent secretary, but also a great mentor. So, what can you tell me about the problem? Ugh, where should I start? I discovered something strange while organizing tax records. Okay. 
There are obvious irregularities in the tax declarations of two stores, Second Life and Wanyo Boutique. However, whether I question the shopkeepers or check their accounts, I, I can't seem to make any progress with my investigation. Okay. Without any evidence, my hands are tied. I see. It's not uncommon for merchants to be blinded by greed. Well, is there any solution you can advise? Naturally. I've dealt with similar issues hundreds of times. Give me a moment to consider the best approach in this scenario. Mm, that's a thousand years of work experience for you. All right. Let's approach it this way, then. Your enemy knows you best. Huh? <laughs> okay. If I remember correctly, Second Life and Wanyo Boutique are old business rivals, competing for market share due to their similar wares. Hmm. In that case... In that case... Ah! I know what you mean, Miss Ganyu. I still don't get it. You want them to expose each other? Exactly. Let's start with Wanyo Boutique. The owner's name is... Bolai, isn't it? Uh, yes, you're right. Follow me, please. Okay, let's go see Bolai. Bolai. Don't mind me, I'm just looking for treasure. In the corners of Leeway. Bye, Toki, I love you. He's such a good cat. The music is so good. I know where you can find a bunch of treasure. It's in chat. Aww. Yeah, this chat is full of treasure. That's so true. That's very sweet, Normie. <laughs> this is very sweet. I think we made it. Am I supposed to talk to you guys? Oop. Oh, this guy. Bulai. Hey, flower guy. <laughs> Aha! We meet again, traveler. Yes. And you must be from the Yuhai Pavilion? <laughs> I suppose you're about to place a big order. I'd be honored to offer you my wares. Okay. That won't be necessary, Mr. Bolai. Wanyo Boutique's credit is not sufficient to accept orders directly from Yuhai Pavilion. Should we need to place such an order, we would certainly go to Second Life instead. Wow, is this how we're doing business? What? Second Life? Ugh, that rascal Dongsheng. He's stealing all of my customers. Freaking Dongsheng. Well, Second Life's credit has always been excellent. And based on their tax records, their business is thriving. <laughs> oh, hmm. Tax records? <laughs> thriving? Huh. Is there anything you'd like to share with us, Mr. Bolai? Don't let that rascal fool you. I know his dirty tricks best. Is he gonna rat him out? If you don't believe me, show me his tax records. I'm sure I'll find something fishy in there. You know Second Life's business so well? Of course. Ugh, their every transaction makes my blood boil. Oof. I'd rather lose money myself than see that rascal make some. Is that how competitors behave? That's really petty. Well then, please look over this tax record. We'll review Second Life's credit based on your observations. We are learning things from the other business based on somebody who's an enemy. But like, who says that this guy's not just gonna lie through his teeth? 
You know what I mean? Oh, of course. I'll read very, very carefully. That is a big update for Fortnite. They're still working on it. Ooh. Line by line and word by word. Ah, here I found it. That exquisite wooden furniture set he bought from Fanmu Carpenters at the beginning of the year. Ugh, he even flaunted it in front of me. Look at the tax record. Not a word about that furniture. And he kept all the profit for himself. I see. He must have gotten rid of all the documents related to this transaction. No wonder there was no trace of it. Oh, what a crook. What if it was a gift? Hmm, <laughs> I told you so. Just as I expected. Ugh, I can't wait to watch him squirm. Wow. What a rat. But, Ms. Ganyu, despite all this, can't he just flat out deny ever making this transaction? He might have destroyed all the evidence, but I believe the supplier, Fanmu Carpenters, might still have some proof of it. Aha! Uh -huh. You're right! Master Lu from Fanmu Carpenters must still have the invoice. He wouldn't be swayed by the likes of Dongsheng. I hope so. Let's go to Fanmu Carpenters. It should be near Chingsa Village. Thank you for shining a light on this case, Mr. Balai. Oh, please, please, that's nothing. I just hope you won't be lenient with him once you find the evidence. That's the best way to show your gratitude. <sighs> I'm afraid I can't go to Chingsa Village. It's all right, Baishin. You can stay in Liyua Harbor and finish your work. Leave the rest to us. Okay. Oh, that's so considerate of you. Still, I'm sorry to trouble you like that. It's okay, we'll go. We'll go. Thanks for, uh, thanks for the tip, guy. Time to go over to there. Somewhere. Way over there. I'm gonna teleport. I'm not gonna walk that. Let's go to there. There's a thing over here. Where is it? Here? Where? Here? I hear it. I can hear it. Oh, there it is. Got it. Heck yeah. Nice. Got the shiny thing. I like shiny things. Um. All right, let's go back up. That's not how we go back up. <laughs> The wings have to spread! This is fine. This is fine. This is fine. Oh my god. This is fine. Okay. <laughs> so close. Stamina. Okay, I'm back up here. And I want to go to over here somewhere.
Moment. We found the guy. Master Lou, there he is. Hi. Ah, welcome, welcome. How can an old carpenter like me help you? Uh, we need to know some information. And we need to know if it's a lie or not. Can you help us? <laughs> I'm usually happy to take new apprentices, but uh, I'm afraid I can't take too many at once. Uh, but I'm always around if you're keen for a chat. <laughs> Kingsa really is full of lonely old people. Hey, I heard that, flying one. <laughs> uh, Diamond, sorry. Master Lu, we've just come to see you and ask you some questions. <laughs> ah, don't worry, I know. You're from the UI Pavilion, right? Wacky Why would the chief seem care about an old man Wacky like waving me? Inflatable arm flailing well, tube man. Wacky waving inflatable arm flailing tube man. You said that you want to ask me something. Ask away then. <laughs> Thanks, Tito. <laughs> <laughs> You're very direct, Master Liu. I will be plain. We're looking for proof that Dongsheng from Second Life has been evading taxation. Dongsheng bought some furniture from you at the beginning of the year. Do you still have the invoice or any other record of that transaction? Oh, it's about Second Life. It was a big order. Hmm. How could I forget? Hey, he did an order. He did it. He's doing tax fraud. Oh my god. Sure enough, Mr. Balai was right. Could we perhaps borrow that invoice? We won't have any evidence to bring against Dongsheng otherwise. Well, of course you can. But I'm not so sprightly anymore. Uh, what's that supposed to mean? Uh, I only do my woodwork and display finished wares here at Fonmu Carpenters. As for old documents and such, I keep them all in a warehouse west of here. But some troublemakers have recently moved there, invading my warehouse. I tried to drive them away, but they just wouldn't leave. Um, that's okay. We'll take care of them. We have swords and bows and fire. Yeah, fire. Since you need that invoice anyway, it may be best to get it from the warehouse yourself. And while you're at it, you can teach those louts a lesson. And we have the power of friendship in anime. That's true. So that's what happened. I see. I'll leave you to it then. I need to get back to work. Okay, sounds good. Bye. Are we just gonna stare at him as he's Take just back walking the warehouse, away? Find the invoice. Time for us to show our stuff in a fight. Yeah, let's do it. Wait, I think I saw one of those troublemakers. Ah. Uh, over there. Oh, Paimon sees them too. <gasps> it's one of the Fatui. Ah, oh, not those guys. I don't like those guys. What are they doing here? They must be plotting something against Liyue Harbor. Maybe they're the scoundrels How dare they? Master Lu's warehouse. Shall we observe him for a while first? Ever since Osile attacked the harbor, the Fatui's reputation in Liyue has reached rock bottom. We won't cause a serious diplomatic crisis by getting into some small scuffle with the Fatui within our borders. You need not worry. Besides, I can already feel their malicious intentions. Consider it my intuition as the secretary of the Chising. Yeah. What are you waiting for? Let's go teach him a lesson. Let's do it. Let's go teach him a lesson. He's like minding his own business, eating his bread. And we're just gonna go there and like kick his butt. I'm gonna switch my party. I don't want Amber in my party. I'm gonna bring back a uh, Chevy, wherever she is. There she is. All right, team, let's move it out. Um, 
Um, and I think I'm gonna switch Noel for Kaya. Ready when you are. For a rock. Um, I'll smack the bread right out of his hands. Yeah, and then eat it. <laughs> Oh, you're gonna feed the pigeons. Okay. And then feed the pigeons! <laughs> that works. I need to eat something. And you can eat something, and then let's eat one of these things. Now let's go kick some booty! Hi, guy. We're about to come get your bread. Berries. It's time for a to be blown away. This Wait. Will be frozen in time. Is he a freezy guy? He is a freezy guy. Inazuma shines eternal. Okay, Inazuma shines eternal in your face. Drop your weapons. Cool it. It is no problem. You're right. Freeze. Shine down. Oh my god, Raiden, you're gonna die. Eat a whole ass chicken, please. I don't have a healer on here. Do we do it? Do we kill him? <laughs> oh, you scoundrels! I think you've had enough. About time you tell us your plan. Plan? What plan? Yeah, he was just minding his own business, eating bread. <laughs> There's no plan. Oh no, not scoundrels! We just taught you a lesson, but clearly you weren't paying attention. If you don't spill whatever you're scheming against Liyue, we'll be forced to use harsher methods. Yeah! I think we were harsh enough. <laughs> Quick, tell us everything. I'm telling the truth. There's no scheme. If you're telling the truth, then why would you, a member of the Fatui, suddenly appear on the outskirts of Chingsa Village? Fine. If you really want to know, then, well... I was about to. About to what? Pick berries over there. Oh, I picked them instead of you. I'm sorry. <laughs> you just wanted berries and I took them while we were fighting. I'm the worst. I'm sorry. I have the berries. Do you want them back? Um, I must admit, I didn't expect you to come up with such a silly excuse. It's not an excuse. I rarely have a free morning, and I heard that there were fresh berries in this area. Oh, wow, took his berries. Listen. Think about it. I'm here alone, and Chinksa Village is nothing more than a retirement spot for old people. What could I be scheming anyway? Judging by how he's looking at us, it does seem like he feels like he's the victim here. Yeah, I told you guys. I told you. He's just minding his own business eating his bread. I knew it. I knew it. So you have nothing to do with the occupation of Fanmu Carpenter's warehouse? Fanmu Carpenter's warehouse? Where's that? I swear, I only came here to pick berries. That's all. So it wasn't the Fatui who took over Master Lu's warehouse after all. We might have blamed him for nothing. I also feel that he's telling the truth. Uh, um, Whoopsies! Whoopsie! You want the berries back? <laughs> I misjudged the situation and offended you. My apologies. Our, uh, 
Our exchange only represents my personal views. If you wish it so, you can file a complaint to the Ministry of Civil Affairs. Exchange? This woman, she's clearly aware that the Ministry of Civil Affairs wouldn't side with us, Fatui. Yes, precisely. As an alternative, you may... try to solve this problem with force once again. Paimon Zin! Darn you. How can you wear that solemn face while bullying me like this? What's your choice, then? I'll get back to my berries. Aww. Uh, good choice. Getting back to his what berries. A bittersweet ending. This is weird. Poor guy, though. <laughs> I made a laughing stock out of myself. I might have spent too much time away from work. My intuition is not as accurate as it used to be. No worries. It's always nice to teach the Fatui a lesson. <laughs> Paimon. <laughs> Paimon, it's fine. He's still kind of a bad guy. <laughs> Let's keep moving towards Master Lu's warehouse. <laughs> Our goal is to get the invoice, after all. I bet his treasure hunter is at the warehouse. Where did the Fatui guy go? Where are the berry guys? Where's the berries, I mean? Aw, he's just gone, gone. He's gone, gone, gone. We beat him up while he was eating bread, and we, uh, and we're a uh, pain in the butt. Cause pain is bread, in French. I understood that. You're funny. I think I might have missed it, but what are you doing for your birthday? I know I asked, but I think I might have missed it. Might have missed what you said. Where's the warehouse? Is it up here? Being sick, I still have COVID. Oh, you have COVID! Oh, that sucks. I thought you were just sick. I didn't know you actually had COVID. Thankfully, it's been a week, so I don't think I'm contagious anymore. Oh, yeah. The stuffy nose and cough. I hope you feel better soon. I'm sorry you have to deal with that. That really sucks. Hi guys. So you want some cookies? This is the warehouse. Seems like those troublemakers were nothing more than a few hair churls. Let's show them what we got. Hi guys. Huh. Illusion shattered. Final warning. Cool it. Windblade, prepare to be blown away. <laughs> Dodge this! Oh, so sorry. Now you shall perish! There is no escape! Get out of there. <clears throat> yeah. Bye. This moment will be frozen in time. Torn to oblivion. <laughs> that was weird timing. 
There is no escape. Stop right there. Dodge this. Illusion shattered. Reinforcements. Oh, there's a big guy. Oh no, there is a big guy, and it's one with a shield. Shine down. Oh, so sorry. Free. Now you shall perish. I switch. Hi, Sir James. Happy Freeze. Friday. Just wanted to swing in and tell y'all you're amazing, deserve the best, and I love you. Hope everyone has a great weekend. Oh, Sir James, that's very kind of you. Happy Friday. Final warning. I hope you have a really good weekend. We love you too. Dodge this. Follow me over here. Follow me over here so I can kick your ass. Come here. Come, come, come. Come, come. Yeah. Rawr. Oh, crap, crap. No, not like that. Not like that, though. Inazuma shines eternal. There is no escape. Snap your weapon. Cool it. Wingly. You asked for it. All clear. Quick. All clear. We did it. We did it investigate we got something but nothing that we need uh, this thing oh my eyes are burning this one is an, an invoice. invoice from one min restaurant some dining tables and chairs that's not it that's this one is wong Chung funeral parlors oh so they make coffins too that it <laughs> Anywhere else? Anywhere else? That's it. Did we miss something? That's too far. Can we go in? Nope. We start climbing houses. Maybe behind. Oh! A reward on the road. Is this the answer to this world? This one is. Ah! Second life! Excuse me. We finally found it! We Let's found it! Back to Let's do it. Let's go back. We found a treasure, too. Thank you. So good looking. Thanks, Nervy. Is this an answer to this world? Oh! I'm falling. Fallen. Uh. Falling. Falling. Ah, 
Ms. Ganyu, you're back. We're back. Yeah, we have a receipt. Here you go. I hope it wasn't too much trouble rushing about like that. Mm, no. I promise to help you and I'll keep my word. Nothing to work. Look, it's the invoice for the transaction between Second Life and Fanmu Carpenters. We, we found it. it. Oh, thank you so much. Now we can solve this problem. Yes. Agreed. How about we go to Second Life and have a nice chat with the owner? Oh, there's gonna be drama! There's gonna be drama! All that because the one guy ratted him out. <sighs> drama. So much drama. And we can just teleport there. That'd be so dramatic. Let's see what happens. Oh wait, it's this guy! Oh no, I like it. I like this guy. He gives me good food. Hi, guy. Welcome, welcome to Second Life. What would you like to buy? Listen, I know that you're like my shopkeep for like tofu and shrimp, but we gotta break your legs. I'm sorry. <laughs> but first, let me get a couple of potatoes. <laughs> Let me just buy a couple of potatoes. How, how am I doing for shrimp? Uh, okay, let's just break his legs. It's fine. <laughs> let's just break his legs. It's okay. <laughs> I'll just steal his, his shrimp. It's fine. Isn't it Huixin from the Yuhai Pavilion? I remember you. Ah. <sighs> I told you that all of my transactions are included in the records. My tax declarations are scrupulous as well. Yeah? Well, tell us about this transaction. I do hope that my business won't be affected by any groundless accusations. Groundless accusations? Mr. Dongsheng, you seem very sure of yourself. So sure of yourself. We're here to shake things up a bit but i sincerely advise that you cease this behavior immediately it is liable to affect the fine you'll need to pay in the end uh no no i'm an honest merchant i would never get involved with any fraudulent sources of profit you got no shame haven't i made myself clear mr dongsheng you've already been proven guilty of tax evasion I just came here to see if you'd confess. Yeah, but what if it was a gift? What if the thing was like literally a gift and it wasn't a purchase? And the other guy's just like saying how he bought the thing but it was not a he didn't actually buy it. He it was a gift. Huh? That's how I like I don't know. I'm 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 trying to like be neutral here. I don't know how leeway taxes work. What? P proven guilty? H how come? That's impossible. Absolutely absurd. Maybe the tax on gifts? Maybe. He's talking without rhyme or reason. Must be crumbling under Ganyu's pressure. Oh no. Time for the finishing blow! <sighs> Mr. Dongsheng, can we you tell have me what this is? proof. I... it... it's an invoice from Fanmu Carpenters. I... I'm... Master Lu, he... he I did didn't... It. Do you admit to tax evasion? This Ew. transaction was Hi, missing Serena. from the tax record. <sighs> I didn't think you'd find out. I didn't leave a single trace. Indeed. We wouldn't have found out if it weren't for Mr. Bolai's aid. Yeah, now we're riding him out. We're riding out Mr. Bolai. <laughs> now we're the rats. <laughs> Bolai? That imp from Wanyo Boutique? So he told on me behind my back. Hmm. He's got his own share of dirty laundry. Tell us. Tell us and we'll let you loose. It's fine. Just give us the tea. Oh, Mr. Dongsheng, I'd like to hear a little more about this dirty laundry. 
Would you care to elaborate? <gasps> wow! This is so bad. Happy Friday, Serena! How are you? I don't think you'll need my guidance for what comes next. <sighs> yes, thank you, Ms. Ganyu. I can take it from here. Oh, jeez. <laughs> That's good. <sighs> I must say, you're truly impressive, Ms. Ganyu. So impressive. Your enemy knows you best. <laughs> to think, you came up with this plan and executed it so masterfully. How's the morning been so far? So far, so good. I'm having a really good day. A really, really good day. Thank you. <laughs> it's actually one of your father's. The Tian Shu's old tricks. I just took some inspiration from it. M my father? Yeah, your father. Pitting your opponent against their enemies and watching them drag each other down from an advantageous position. That's how Uncle Tian managed to keep his position in the Qixing secure for so many years. I figured that as Uncle Tian's daughter, you'd naturally grasp your father's strategies. So I decided to use one of your father's tricks and play it out for you to see. <sighs> I can see it now. Clearly, I still have a lot to learn about my father. I'm really grateful, Ms. Ganyu. <laughs> You're the kindest mentor I've ever had. Thank you. Now kiss. <laughs> Ganyu solved both Hoishin's work and family problems. Two birds with one stone. Scone, scone, scone. We don't need to kill the birds. We can feed them. <laughs> Go. Oh, you've helped me so much. You must... <sighs> You must allow me to repay your kindness. Ah, uh, that's not necessary. No need to be so serious. It was nothing, really. Then let me treat you to a meal. Hmm? The Traveler and Paimon are invited as well. I appreciate your help. All right, come on, Ganyu. Just say yes. Let's eat. <laughs> Don't forget your manners. Oh, come on! It's just a meal! If it's just a meal, there's no reason for me to decline. It'll be my pleasure, Huixin. <laughs> Cute. Actually, I've already booked Senor Kiosk. I need a moment to prepare everything first. Let's meet there in a while. Okay. Hmm. All right. Speak we don't <laughs> refuse such generosity. Paimon sandwich? Yeah. Where's my Paimon sandwich? Oh my god. Hi, Omni. Hello. How you doing? You're breathtaking. You're breathtaking. Where to now? Let's follow the yellow brick road. Happy Friday. Yay. I love Leeway. It's so beautiful here. Can we go in here? Thanks for that, Serena. <laughs> Oop, wrong buttons. All right, let's sit. Let's have food. Miss Ganyu, thank you for accepting my invitation. And as for the two of you, your presence is also much appreciated. Sure! That's so kind of you, Huixin. You went to great lengths to organize this. <laughs> Truth be told, 
apart from thanking you for all the help, there's something I'd like to tell you. They are. Oh? If there's anything I can help you with, just tell me straight away. No need to hesitate. Oh, uh, no, no, I, I don't really need help. Uh, could you just listen for a bit? With pleasure. <laughs> uh, when I was a little girl, my father used to tell me many stories about you, Ms. Ganyu. Even though I have the utmost respect for my father, I always admired how gentle and reliable you are. Full context is important. Full context? I've only decided to join the Yuhai Pavilion staff because I've always looked up to you. I didn't know that you think so highly of me. However, in reality, working at the Yuhai Pavilion turned out to be an arduous task. I can't compare myself to such an outstanding secretary like you. I often doubt myself as a result. I disagree. You're a great secretary in your own right. <laughs> Thank you. Over the years, I became a mother, too. Huh? So Uncle Tian is a grandpa! <laughs> Influenced by my youthful ideals, she followed my footsteps and came to be a secretary at the Yuhai Pavilion, too. Oh. At first, I was worried about her. It's not an easy job, after all. To tell the truth, I'm still unsure if she's capable enough. But after all that happened this time, I've made up my mind to support her choice. So, what made you change your mind? <sighs> the fact that she'll have you, Ms. Ganyu, as her senior colleague. You'll help her, gentle as always, and tell her your mom used to do it like that. <laughs> It'd be such a beautiful moment. If it's not too much to ask for, she might still need your guidance in 20 plus years, too. Huishin, I. I never thought that I meant so much to you. Aww. <laughs> Just like when you showed me my father's trick. Having you as their witness makes people feel at ease. Witness? It's true that I've witnessed thousands of years of Liyue Harbor's history. All the ch- But I've always regarded it as nothing more than the source of my loneliness. Huishin, you don't know how important those words are to me. That's so sweet. You've made me realize that I share another connection with the people of Liyue Harbor. Apart from my contract with Rex Lapis, they rely on me, accept me, and long for me to bear witness to their stories. Oh, of course. You're irreplaceable to us. <laughs> That's right. That's why I can't disappoint you. Hooray! Ganyu's finally cheered up! Even if I've really been supplanted, I wish to fight for my place. I won't let you down. I'm going to fulfill my contract and keep working as the Chi Sing secretary. Hmm, I told you you haven't been... Wait, I told you you haven't been? You haven't been fired. It's a misunderstanding. Regardless, I'll go back and see for myself. <clears throat> I'm afraid that it might have all become a mess during my absence. <laughs> Yeah, the background music's good. No time to waste. Let's get back to work. Good luck, Miss Ganyu. Hi, DJ. Thanks for the pets. <laughs> uh, we're leaving already? Paimon's still hungry. Aww. Then eat! Eat!
Eat! Where are we going? What are we doing? Gotta get out of here? Anything shiny around here that I can take? <laughs> can I steal something? That's terrible. Okay, where do we have to go? Over there. How are you and the Ganyu quest doing really, really good? And the quest is a lot of fun. How are you? I'm just climbing walls. Doing okay, just being cozy. Fortnite is down for another five hours. Ah, I guess I'm gonna have to stream for another five hours. <laughs> ah, ha, ha. maybe not five hours, but um, you know. <laughs> Aisha, are you okay? Did you fall asleep standing up? Look! Look who's back! You even have enough time for leisure? It seems you three are a suitable replacement for me after all. Oof. Not at all! We just... We've been working for too long. If we didn't take a break, we wouldn't have survived long enough to see you again, Miss Ganyu. Aww. Miss Ganyu, we've missed you. <laughs> That's so kind of you all, given we've only met once. We've been praying day and night for you to return and take over your Hi, duties Pei. again. To us, you're like an adeptus coming down to the human world to save all life. Forget all our envious complaints from before. Just free us from this strenuous work, please. All right. All right, I see. Please divide the matters at hand into government affairs, business affairs, and civil affairs. Mark out the tasks that haven't been started and those that are in progress. I'll take care of the rest. Of course. We'll do it right away. Oh, finally. <laughs> We're saved. Uh, yes. There's one more thing. I'd like to earnestly thank you, Traveler. If it weren't for your companionship, I would still be embroiled in my inner conflict right now. It was fun adventure for me, too. <laughs> to think that I'd gained a human friend outside of work. It makes me happier than I could have imagined. I'd like to repay you when I'm done with the work at hand. What would you say if I accompanied you on one of your trips? Sure, but are you ever done with work on you? What? Hmm. Uh, let's cross that bridge when we come to it, shall we? Okay. We did it! That's it. It's over. That was really good. That was, that was good. I thought there would be like more of a fighting. Like you know how we go into these dungeons usually when we do these stories? We did it. Yep. Hooray! That was Ganyu's story and that was a good story. Now we know more about Ganyu. Look at this view. Thanks for being here for that story. On to the next. On to the next. Yeah.